In Madden 24, there are currently seven LTDs in packs, including Deion Sanders, Chris Carter, Deron Bland, Leonard Floyd, Trevor Lawrence, Jimmy Ward, and Kyren Williams. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we're doing a pack opening to try and pull all of them. I currently have three Star Elite packs, six Harvest packs, three Pro Playmakers, one Legend pack, one Max Fans pack, and honestly, the market's crashed. And we do have Team Diamonds dropping tomorrow, which I might make a video on that. Man, it's been a while since I actually recorded like a non, no money spent, just straight pack opening video for you boys. But yeah, I can show you my investment really quick. I haven't updated the team really at all. We have 500,000 coins. However, when I go to my like item binder, you can see I stocked up on some like 88s, 89s before, like all those like rows, a couple thousand. Any of 90, 91s are crashing in price. So that's how I got the packs. I bought 91s at 160 and I bought 90s at like 103,000 coins. But as you can see, I've saved actually 91s. I'm actually upset there's no gold card in the sets, but I saved a lot of like 80s to 85s actually through the past like few days, even 84s I've saved. And I also have like William Perry and Ken Riley if they're going to go up in price. 92's kind of stayed at their level 300 right now because those are the top end cards in the game. I even say like Malik, Cam Chancellors, um, Charles Leno. So when Team Diamonds actually drop, I actually will sell a lot of these cards and hopefully I'll make a million plus coins on those. And I'm just going to do exchange sets with my 79's to 80 overalls and hopefully that will balance out for me to get a lot of profit. But yeah, might as well open these packs. If we get one limited animation, I'll be so happy. Oh, there's also 91 Reduxes, so we'll actually be able to get one of the 91 Reduxes, potentially, if we see the Redux animation. So let's start with the packs that actually will not guarantee anything. Like, let's go with the Gold and the Max Fantasy. I have pulled Limited, though, out of the Max Fantasy, as we get Kevin Harris there. I just, I don't know. I feel like packs have kind of... They've been hit or miss. Sometimes they're like extremely good. Like this could be an 87 and I would call it a really good, but it also could be a 79. And I was saving, dude, the amount of kickers slash punters I need to show you guys after this that I have saved up because I all the gold cards, like, oh my gosh. But that is an amazing pack. 82, 80, or 83, 81, 84, especially because those are like Ravens and even, what were they? Like Washington Steelers. Like those are going to be pretty expensive team diamonds just because those are the most popular teams for Madden. Now we have six harvest packs. I forgot to do the math on how many packs we actually have here or how many coins we have. So we have about a million in coins right here. If we see the big animation and the limited animation, that'd be sick. And we do not, sadly. But again, we have like five, six of these packs. And I want to get a video up to you guys halfway through the week because I usually don't do these. I usually been updating on Mondays. But you know what? Maybe we'll pull like a couple 89s. A couple 89s is really good. I think if we pull like three 89s here, that'd be really nice. Come on. Gotta give me at least one 85. 85s are actually pretty nice too. Um, a two, a two. Yeah, because we're going jump pack, jump ship here. Let's go to the pro playmakers. Usually those are extremely good. And oh, bro, the legend packs, man. Oh my gosh. Jeremy Chin just got a 92. That's a little bit of a troll EA. Not gonna lie. But the, um, the legend packs, I haven't pulled a full legend animation in forever. Wow, this is actually a really good pack. And like, I, when I get, like, these base elites, those are going to be huge tomorrow. So I'm actually really happy that I'm doing this. Because I'll have so many coins just to filter through. They'll probably be, like, 20k, maybe. Um, but we'll see. Pack values are going to go skyrocketing in the next few days. A1s, man, I want to back out. These are really bad. But you guys can see, I have 53 punters and 36 kickers. Like, I was ready, man. I was so ready for this. I did pick up a Nakobe Dean, so if those teamed uh, things are in there, that'd be good. But like, all these 74s, bro. I was so ready. Look at these 49ers. Oh, what? Oh, Seahawks, Cowboys, man. I was so ready. I'm taking a kind of big risk here, honestly. We haven't pulled anything super big, so... I don't know, but here we go. We gotta get one, just one big, 192, bro. That's all I'm asking, 192. Come on, man. But I really do think it is possible to hit something crazy out here. An 86 and 85 is pretty decent. I know those 92s are like, like I know we're going to pull a limited today. I don't know how, but I will. Big legend, 92. Paint, I, I jumped the gun. I shouldn't have been that cocky with it, but still. Either way, I want to see that limited animation so bad, bro. So bad. It's going to be an 86, I think. Oh, A1. This is going to be a big card. 87. Nice. I'll take an 87. That's not bad, especially for the Lions. I'll take that. So we only have three more or four more packs left. I don't know. I'm still hopeful, though. I still think we can pull a limited uh, A3. And there's seven limiteds in packs, bro. You got to toss me one, right? Just one? No? No. Well, might as well open the legend pack, right? We already pulled... A full legend. I guess I guess now I've pulled a full legend, but now I have a legend pack, bro. As I say, what is this? 88 Calvin. Not horrible. Not horrible. Uh, do we get two animations? Ooh. No, we don't. A3 DJX. Okay. 
That's not horrible, but 88. You want nine, like you want 92 pulls. It's just extremely hard to pull those guys. Um, it, I've seen limited though. Uh, that's Malik. That's good. Like 81s, like bro. Like look at that. Only 80, 81s. Like that's horrible in terms of pack value. Yikes. Just yikes. Harvest Pack's going to give us an 85, 25. Those used to be so big. 92. Let's go. Dexter Lords. I'll take that. Let's go. Coffee too, bro. Finally pulled a big 92. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go, bro. But 92, 300K. Yes, sir. Oh, thank God. Whew. So that means the rest of the cards that we got only needs to make out like 300K. And with these 82s being how expensive right now, they're like 4K piece. They'll shoot up probably to what? What are we thinking? 10K? If that happens, oh, we're in business. Is Tony Pollard so expensive? I don't know. Let's see. 14. Like, those. that's a pretty expensive 85. I'll take that. 165 for Tillman's not horrible. Dude, I'm actually really, like, dude, I could buy, like, I could have bought, like, a really good team with this crash. Um, and I have 160K. Oh, I better be ready to sell so much stuff, bro. So much stuff. This is going to be, this is such a risky play by me. But why not? Why not risk it, bro? Because, like, honestly, if we pull a D on, we profit anyway. <laughs> so that was, like, nine packs. I'll take that. We got two of almost everything. That's not horrible. Max Fantasies can give us something good later. Um, gold cards, I've seen an 88 pull out of it. That's my best pull. I pulled an 88 out of a gold card a couple days ago, um, which was really cool. But other than that, I don't know. Max Fantasies, bro. Like, I've pulled a limited out of Max Fantasy. I said that earlier. But man, like, like, look at that, bro. We need like guaranteed elites in like this round for sure, and we do not have it. Wow, that's the first time I've actually seen gold. Eighty-nine Devonte Parker. I'll take that. That's our half the uh, coins we risk for that ninety-one, which is awesome. But like, see what I mean? Like, they can be glitchy, bro. But like, that's the first time I've ever seen that gold Russell Wilson card. That card probably would have been like four hundred k, like day one of diamonds, if the diamonds were a QB. But apparently, diamonds like it's so weird that diamonds doesn't have a QB master. It's only Todd Gurley and um, JJ Watt, which is cool cards. Don't get me wrong. I just. I don't know. It's one of those things. Yeah, I got an 89 out here. I'll take all. Actually, no, I shouldn't take the 78. I should take the 79s. Just because I can exchange those for 80s and probably make like 10k a piece. But like, I don't know. I feel like some of these are like, like super good, super bad. We pulled an 89 though. This could be also an 8. Like every time I see this, I'm gonna call an 89. Because why not, right? Um, 89. Nope. <laughs> I do like bouncing around the packs. So I think bouncing around packs just makes makes it so much more cool. Like so much cooler. Can we pull something above an 85? I haven't done that in a pro playmaker today. Makes you sad, man. 85? Come on, A2s. Just throw me a 91 and we'll be even. Nope. <laughs> gosh, I would have quick sold a 91. Oh my gosh, we pulled something above an 85. Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> and actually, Eagles to sign Reddick is probably going to be super expensive tomorrow, too. I'm just so ready for Team Diamonds, man. I want to sell so much stuff. Uh, 87? Is an 87. Not bad, not bad. A1 and... Oh, I thought we were going to get two 87s out of that. That'd been crazy. This roll hasn't been bad. 89, 87. Um, if we get two 89s, we'll profit, I think. Uh, no big animation, though, sadly. And. Ah, seven limiteds in packs. Just a bunch of 85s, man. Just a bunch of 85s. Man. Rough, rough, rough. Oh, big legend. Come on. This could be really big. Uh, 88. I mean. Like, that's that's okay. I'll take an 88. 88 to like 60k. Um, now, do we profit? In terms of training, I don't think we did. Uh, let me actually check here. See what we got in terms of training value. So, this is what we got last time. So, that one roll was about 30k. We got 23 back. I mean, that's not horrible. Especially because most of these cards are above training value. Like, those 89s are above training value. The 88s, I think, are like selling for 60. Ooh. There's something below training. Man, okay. Well, we'll see tomorrow. We'll see where like all that lands. But overall, I'm I'm pretty happy. I, I call this a successful pack opening. So we have about 100K in training right now just off this pack opening. I got to admit, most of these cards are above training value anyway, which is awesome because that means it's a guaranteed one point something mil, which means we made our coins back. But if the market shoots up to like 15 per on some of these 85s, maybe 82s, we're going in profit by like 700k i think tomorrow it's going to be a good day thank you so much for watching this pack up i haven't done like a video like this in a really long time hopefully i can do more of these in the future more in-person stuff and if you're new here subscribe like uh hit that bell while you're at it because you get notified when i upload and i think more of these like mid-week uploads are going to happen a lot 
frequently now i just finished like two of my classes in terms of presentation slash finals wise and a week from now i'll be done with all my classes so you guys will see so much content and streams it during like christmas um like that like break and stuff you're going to see so much in-person stuff too it's it's gonna be incredible but yeah thank you so much for watching boys i love you god loves you more hope you all have a blessed rest of your day peace